When you think of family, what comes to mind first? A story of hope? Of despair? We are certainly familiar with those RPG games where heroes travel through foreign lands where they find new companions and fight the evil to save the world. But Children of Morta is an RPG of a family where everyone hacks together to bring back peace in the Mountain of Morta. Children of Morta is an isometric RPG roguelike where players must dive deep into mysterious dungeons where the fight awaits. Bergson's residence is located by the front entrance of the beautiful Mountain of Morta. Bergson's family is tasked to protect the mountain. John, the father and leader of the family, discovered that the path which the family uses to travel is corrupted by ancient evils. The corruption was found to be creeping into Bergson's protected land. John then called for a meeting with Grandma Margaret and his wife Mary to assemble all the family members to protect the mountain. Children of Morta is an action RPG and its gameplay is a simple one. The player is to control a character into the dungeon and hack their way through enemies to ultimately defeat the boss. The control is designed to be easily picked up there is the main attack button that can be constantly used, skill buttons and item buttons, whose usage requires a cooldown. These buttons are shown on the game interface, making it easy to memorize. Wrong. The life crystal, as if to the brim with life. The family traits system is what makes this game stand out from others. Not all of them are fighters. Some play a supporting role in the family. Uncle Ben is one of the Bergsons and is a blacksmith who forges weapons and armors for everyone in the family. The hero's rates of attack, defense or stats will depend on the upgrade of Uncle Ben's workshop. Or Margaret who possess the Book of Rhea that allows more stock capacity of items picked up from the dungeon when upgraded. Children of Morta's skills system is straightforward. Every time you level up, you will acquire one skill point to put in the skill tree to unlock more skills. Skills are categorized as passive and active skills. Passive skills provide an immediate effect. For active skills, the player must actively use them. The heroes also have five family skill tiers, which, once unlocked, will become passive skills for all members. Children of Morta is designed to look like you're reading a children's bedtime story. A palette choice of light and dark green mixed with brown represents forests and mountains. Each shot contains details and myriad colours play to make you feel like traversing through a bedtime storybook. The corruption scenes, on the other hand, show cruelty and sorrow. It is a contrast between the warmth of family love and the disparity of death. The poor herbalist of no values. What is prominent about the sound of Children of Morta is the storytelling that feels a lot like listening to a bedtime story, describing the hero's emotions and events that are happening. Mark had to warn them about the dangers approaching, despite how difficult it was to talk. The game scores are sad, lonely music. The music in the Bergson's residence is slow instrumental. while mysterious music triggering curiosity plays in the dungeons, which suit well with other sound effects like doors closing and the fire lighting up. Talking about the distinct system of Children of Morta, it has to be the family system from family skills, weapons and armors upgrades to family items. The game focuses on heroes depending on each other to present the message that the power of family can help you complete the dungeons. 
Items like runes serve as the power of other heroes that were created to entwine with the hero who found it. All of this might not be a new thing, but it is undeniably distinctive. And this is Play Prime Stats that show you this game's characteristics. For Children of Morta, it focuses on creating a balance between the main story and characters' stories. Children of Morta presents its feature by utilising unique family-style gameplay and storybook-style storytelling, along with exceptional sound effects. These aspects, just like the Bergson family, form a strong pillar, and that is what makes Children of Morta a great game. And for this game, the reviewer recommends you to get Sometimes you protect the world by protecting someone you love. Subscribe to Play Prime for more reviews and follow us on social media. Thanks for watching.